Hey guys, survival here. I've got a survival tip for you. Anytime you go out bush, carry some aluminium foil with you. It's an extremely handy thing to have and it is well worth its extremely minimal weight. A couple examples of things you can make with it. A quick improvised bowl. Simply support it underneath and you're good to go. If you make it a bit deeper and a smaller diameter, you can have a cup which looks more like a cone but works just as well or all, all the same. By flattening it out, you can make a little reflector or heat shield, which will redirect any radiant heat back towards you when placed on the other side of an appropriately sized fire. Just make sure you keep the foil far enough back from the fire that it doesn't actually start to melt or catch fire or get holes burnt in it. Um, this foil is thin, so I would advise you to double it over a few times, but it will reflect heat back. It can also work as a windshield. So once again, form something like this, but usually it'll be around this height. Uh, don't fold it up as quite as many times as I have here. And then simply bring it around your source. It would of course be a much larger diameter, but this is just to give you the idea. Just bring it around, hook it under, fold it down, and you've got yourself a nice little windshield in case your spirit burner is starting to get snuffed out with too much breeze. If you do get an actual decent name brand foil, you'll usually get a slightly thicker foil than the cheaper store brands. Uh, your mileage may vary, uh, as this depends on where in the world you are and what quality of product most people, most places you, you know, produce in your area. Uh, here in Australia, we can use the store brand. However, for the most part, um, there's only really one store brand that's actually good. Um, however, all the name brand foil is of a decent thickness and works really well. So I've got one last thing to show you that you can make. It does tear, just stop tearing, stop the tear, hold it partly over, forming a bit of a profile like, like that. And you just fold down and it'll crimp back in. That'll help minimize any increasing the tear the funnel so the funnel is actually a really easy method simply roll it up from one corner then out at the bottom simply shape it around a stick a twig your finger whatever it's a little hard to see due to the length of it but that is a funnel and I can see light through the bottom of it and that will allow you to fill a container to transfer stuff from one container to another safely or in the case of you needing to move water simply hold the bottom taut scoop it through water lift it up when it's vertical simply gently form it back to shape and the water under its own weight will help reform through the bottom and let it come gushing out the bottom where you need it to be. Aluminium foil, carry it with you all the time. And remember, stay safe in the bush.